the week before the closure was released, I got an email from my diversity and inclusion contact saying, hey, B, the closure is gonna be released. I'm B Pagels Minor. My pronouns are they, them, theirs. I am a former employee of Netflix. I responded back saying, you know, what's the content? What does it look like? By the very next day, I started getting messages from employees saying, I am in a really bad space mentally wise. Like, I feel like I'm not sure why I work here. Like this has caused me to question everything and how disturbing it was that our own company had made our employees feel that way. But the entire response from the senior team was, you people are just not smart enough. You're not intelligent enough. My former role at Netflix was as the finance and membership data product manager. I had begun really trying to craft a really great ROI memo numerically. While many of Dave Chappelle's specials would get Netflix a tremendous amount of controversy and even nominations for awards and some wins, it did not, by our own standards, generate the return on our investment that some other specials that were far cheaper, that were far less offensive, were able to generate. Not only did you allow hateful content to go out, but you let hateful content go out that was less profitable than content that does not cause harm. And unfortunately, someone leaked that memo, and then I was terminated. That just started this whole cascade of like first thinking about creating a transgender day of quiet. So like transgender folks at Netflix were gonna kind of take the day off. But because of Ted Sarando's responses to everything, you know, first the email, then the memos, they were just so off tone. We decided that it was gonna be a walkout instead. 